In this video, let us consider the example 4.4. So in this problem, we need to design the circuit to establish a drain voltage of 0.1 volt. And also, we need to find the effective resistance between drain and source at this operating point. The data given is threshold voltage of the MOSFET is 1 volt. K and dash into W by L equals 1 milli ampere per volt square. The given circuit is as shown here. Supply voltage VDD equals 5 volt. Drain voltage VD equals 0.1 volt. In the first step, let us determine the region of operation of NMOS transistor. VG equals 5 volt. Since the gate of the MOSFET is tied to the VDD, VG equals 5 volt. The source is at uh, ground potential. So from this, we can estimate VGS. VGS equals VG minus VS. VG is 5 volt. VS is 0 volt. Therefore, VGS is 5 volt. VD from the given data, it is 0 0.1 volt. VD and VDS both are same since source is at ground potential. VD equals 0 0.1 volt. This implies VDS also 0 0.1 volt. Once we know gate voltage, drain voltage, we can easily estimate VGD. The formula to estimate VGD is VG minus VD, where VG is 5 volt, VD is 0 0.1 volt. Therefore, VGD is 4.9 volt. From the circuit, we estimated VGD, which is found to be 4.9 volt. But the threshold voltage of the transistor is given as 1 volt. Now, to determine the region of operation, we can compare VGD, gate to drain voltage, and threshold voltage of the MOSFET. So, VGD is 4.9 volt. Threshold voltage is 1 volt. VGD is greater than VT. Therefore, the transistor operates in triode region. In next step, we will use triode current equation to find the drain current value. The drain current expression in triode region is given by ID equals K and dash W by L into VGS minus VT times VDS minus half of VDS square. Substituting the given data, K and dash into W by L equals 1, VGS is 5 volt, VT is 1 volt, VD or VDS is 0.1. So simplifying this, ID, we found that it is 0 0.395 milli ampere. In the step 3, we will estimate the RD value. The required value of RD from the circuit can be calculated as follows. The portion of the circuit to find the RD value is as shown here. VDD is 5 volt. RD which we need to estimate. VD or VDS equals 0 0.1 volt. For this portion of the circuit, if we can apply Kirchhoff voltage law, which gives minus VDD plus ID times RD plus VD or VDS which is given as equal to 0. Rearranging this, RD is found to be VDD minus VD divided by ID. Substituting the values of VDD, VD and ID, RD is found to be 12.4 kilo ohm. This is approximated to 12 kilo ohm which is the standard value. Now to determine the effective drain to source resistance of the transistor since the transistor operates in triode region. So in triode region the drain to source voltage is very small. The formula used to find effective drain resistance is as follows. RDS the drain to source resistance or effective drain to source resistance across the transistor is drain to source voltage by drain current. VDS which is 0.1 volt. ID is 0.395 milliampere which we get RDS as 253 ohms. 
we can observe here the RDS value drain to source resistance value is very small 253 ohms. Now we can complete the circuit by substituting all the values which we have estimated. Supply voltage given is 5 volt. VGD which we estimated as 4.9 volt. VGS is 5 volt. Threshold voltage of this transistor is 1 volt. So the transistor operates in triode region. The effective drain to source resistance is 253 ohms. The drain to source voltage or drain voltage equals 0.1 volt. So this is the circuit which has been designed.